we're back with CNN Headline News. I'm Chuck Roberts. Nice to have you looking later. A new device that could help save bus companies millions of dollars in court litigation. Don't go away. There are about 30 bus wrecks a year in Los Angeles alone involving pedestrians. One California bus company is experimenting with a device that could help save people's lives. Here's Greg Lamont with that. Barbara Lagerborg and her husband used to love biking. It was their shared passion. The two often biked as much as 3,000 miles a year. But the last time Barbara Lagerborg got on a bike was December 30th, 1995. I heard the bus behind me, and I don't know what happened. Um, next thing I knew, I felt the bus hitting me, and I ended up on the street, and I looked down, and my leg was missing. Barbara was run over by the rear tire of the bus. She lost her left leg just below the knee. She sued and won $3 million. On average, there are about 30 bus-related accidents in Los Angeles each year involving pedestrians that result in injuries or death. It's estimated 40 to $80 million a year are paid out nationwide as a result of pedestrians being struck by buses. But look at this. It's called a people catcher. It's installed over the right rear tire of the bus. It's that tire that pulls up along the curb and is most often responsible for injuries involving pedestrians. The manufacturer of the people catcher demonstrated how it works. Instead of the rear wheel rolling over the person, they are simply pushed away. The maker of the device says it would have helped Barbara Lagerborg. This would have uh, plowed her body out of the uh, wheel, uh, the, the direction of the wheel as the bus was traveling. The Montebello, California bus district is experimenting with the device on several of its buses. People that get trapped on the way out the door, the door gets closed on them. Uh, they get yanked for a little bit, they, they lose their bearings, and next thing you know, they're on the ground. It costs about $1,000 per bus to install a people catcher. They won't stop accidents, but they could save a load of money in litigation. And more importantly, save life and limb. Greg Lamont, CNN. Montebello, California.